Let's talk about what can get in the way of your success. You were created for greatness, for success, and you were created as an infinite being. What that means is that you have no limits. You have no limits. Whatever you were created for, you can accomplish. But what gets in the way of success is your limiting beliefs, is the obstacles you have put yourself in the path. It's the, the personalities and identities you have, you have adopted as yours. Oh, I'm not that kind of person. You've done this to yourself. Or better said, your finite mind who, which is, who is trained to keep you safe and by keeping you safe, it keeps you the same, right? Like the brain is wired to keep us safe. So the way it does that is by just continuing to do the same thing you've always done. And unfortunately, what you've been doing all this time are habits that you have adopted as limits in your life. If you think of little kids, like my, I have an eight year old right now and she wants to be a gymnast, a nurse, a vet, a horseback rider. She wants to do all these things. And I'm thinking, you should pick one girl because I don't think you can do all of those. Says who? Says mom who has bought into her own limiting beliefs and who understands based on reality, the reality that we've created, that she can't be all those things. But my daughter is pure and infinite and unlimited. And we are called to become more like kids, or better said, to unbecome, so that we may go back to our pure state of infinite in beings that we are. Why is this important? You are called to fulfill your purpose, to succeed in life, because in doing so, you're also helping others succeed by bettering humanity. And until you understand that you get to on become all these limits that you have adopted as yours, you're not going to be able to succeed. And the way that you do that is by understanding that we as human beings tend to make everything that's infinite, finite. Our brains, wired to keep us safe and keep it all the same, also know how, how to interpret life through our senses. That's how we interpret reality. And our senses, we're not gonna get into this, but our senses, according to quantum physics, can only interpret or can only see 0.00000001% of reality. So can you imagine here you are thinking you know everything because of what you see, what you hear, what you feel, what you smell. And the truth is that in the end, that's just a little tiny percentage of reality. But when you live in abundance, when you live as the infinite being that God created you to be, you know that what you see and what you can experience through your senses is just a part of it. And the rest you entrust to God and you and you just follow directions as you live that guided life with God as your guide. So if you want to succeed in life, all those buts and I can't because you get to eliminate from your vocabulary and you get to ask, how do I fill in the blank, my dear God? Make it a prayer, connect with God, ask him to guide you. And you'll see that all those limitations that are self-imposed, you get to remove by simply trusting in God. If you enjoyed this video, please like and share. And remember to subscribe and go to betterwithbetsy.com for more resources.